is Eric with Kafaro, and I wanted to break down my Rogan. Uh, this is my uh, fishing rig that I keep in my car. It's not my fully dedicated steelhead. That would be more for if I was either hiking up or I was going to make a whole day out of it. This would be more of a on the way home from work kind of deal. Not really sure what I'm going to run into, but it's a good rig for uh, getting on some fish. So I like the insulated bottle. I've got a hydro flask with a, a cap cap on there. I've got our Gen 2 water bottle pocket. And I like this over the Gen 1 water bottle pocket because it can hold a Gatorade bottle or a standard water bottle or a beer. Um, it can hold a bunch of stuff in there and uh, it's kind of a little dump pouch. In the front here, I've got a, um, a buff in case the bugs are really bad or uh, I don't want to burn. I am a ginger. I've got regular snelled hooks. I've got a leader if I'm fly fishing. I've got some split shot, a couple of different size uh, swivels if I'm switching out quite a bit. I've got clear bubbles for doing a uh, uh, cheater fly, uh, flying a bubble on a spinner reel. I've got my line clipper and I have this inside my pack. I keep it on a zinger. The zinger is not attached. I just have this hooked around the, the little um, pin. If I find that I need this instead of my hemostats, I'll show you here in a minute, my hemostats have blades on them, so I just keep it down to one tool. I've got a little bit of tippet in case I am uh, rigging up some extra stuff. I've got top ride, good old shake and bake. This will dry out your fly. I've got some gink, some floating. In here I've got all of my spinners, uh, a little bit of everything, mostly Panther Martins. i got a Mr. Twister in there, some spoons, some cast masters. And then this is my general uh, do everything, both hardware box. I've got swivels, uh, sinkers, some uh, split shot in there, a couple of floatings. And then uh, I've got just a small selection of flies. Last time I set this up, I was going after um, panfish down in Denver. So there's a lot of annoying flies in there that they will hit on. And then in the back, I've got a 43X and a fricky holster with a, a light on there. On this side, this is, uh, if I know that there's bass in there, I will get out some of the, the crankbaits that goes on the floor. I've got uh, some hoppers, so if they are hitting some topwater stuff or if there's a lot of overhanging cover, I'll get out the hopper box and the floating and go after them that way. I've got a couple of bobbers if I'm feeling like getting real lazy and just chilling by the, the water. So that's kind of my general um, on the way home from work, just need to uh, get a hook wet set up with the Rogan. This is on our battle belt, and then it has a non-standard belt that I won't show there. But uh, we've got our Gen 2 water ball pocket. It'll hold everything. Our standard Rogan up front. I've got a uh, hemostats with blades. I prefer these because uh, I like to only really have one tool. I don't like messing with the line nippers. Um, and then I leave this largely open because I put my car keys and my wallet in here. Uh, I don't want to lose either of those things. And then I've got a real heavy duty retractor in here. This is a net retractor, but I know it's not going to break. So I got a little bit extra space if I'm leaning over or if I'm trying to keep the fish in the water.